I first had the idea of getting a Tico from reading a review in Bayon Pianic magazine. Daewoo means the great or mighty Wu in Korean. Mr. Kim Wu Jung was the owner of the company until it went bankrupt in 1999. Based on the 1988 Suzuki Alto, the 796cc three-cylinder Tico began production in 1991 and was very popular in Romania, Bulgaria, Macedonia, Croatia, Slovenia and Peru. I was introduced to a non-working 1994 Tico which had been sitting at a near nearby house for three years. It was in a sorry state, flat tyres and battery, but I bought it for $500. Thinking it would be easy to get it going again, I bought a new battery and some petrol. It was not going to be so easy. Rats had chewed through some wires and the carburetor was full of thick black sludge. After a lot of cleaning, I got the engine to run for a few minutes. Then, an ominous noise and silence. The timing belt had snapped. I removed the cylinder head and saw the bent valves. With new valves, oil seals, timing belts and spark plugs, the car was drivable. But the mixture was always too rich. The plugs were black and sooty. I put this down to the age of the car, made in 1994. However, the car soon began leaking oil, first drips, then in a steady stream, and it soon became embarrassing. There was nothing for it but to take the whole engine out and see what the problem was. New oil seals were fitted and the engine replaced. I did all this alone. No one helped me. Then I discovered the real cause of the problem. An o-ring had perished in the carburetor and it was flooding. This caused a rich mixture and let petrol flow into the oil. The petrol had diluted the oil and leaked past the oil seals. I also removed a heap of wires, pipes and actuators that served no useful purpose. All back together, the car was much better to drive and pass the vehicle inspection test. I had it wrapped in purple satin film for a hundred dollars. There was a slight problem with the starter motor. I could not get replacement parts and had to improvise. Eventually it stopped functioning. But I had tracked down another Tico kept for spare parts at a nearby town. The new starter motor was much better. Fifteen dollars well spent. There was an added bonus from replacing the starter motor. The throttle angle and vacuum sensor plugs on the carburetor must have been making a poor connection for all the time that I had the car. This time they actually started working properly and it transformed the dynamics of the engine. Previously it always changed from second gear into top third gear, too early and slipped a bit. Now it hangs on to second until 4000 rpm and doesn't slip when it goes into top gear. It also hangs on to first gear for longer. Much more pleasurable to drive, more in keeping with my driving style. It has just passed a new vehicle inspection test so I am very happy.